Hello and welcome to Telltale's adaptation of Game of Thrones. Here we have some nice exposition. If you've never read the show, read the books or played the game. Ah, we got a nice little band of boys, eh? Couple of boys having a couple of drinks around the fire. Nothing like that on a Saturday night. All sharing a tent, nothing like that, eh? Just a bit of rough and tumble with the lads. Go on, take your clothes off. Yeah, come on. Take a hold of the shaft there. There we go, lad. Make sure it's bloody spotless, mate. It's a little known fact that George R. R. Martin wrote all his characters with Australia in mind. Only instead of all the animals wanting to kill you, it's all the people. Oh my goodness, it's Lord Forrester. My lord, would you please sign my face? I'm gonna be the strong silent type for the rest of the game because it's a telltale game. It's a game where you tell no tales. Oh, look at that invisible wine. Crack out Mr. Bigglesworth. Let's all have a bit of a tea party. I'm not gonna say anything because I'm the strong silent type. A blank character, a canvas upon which you can write your own character, or insert yourself as the case may be. Now self-insertion is not something to be afraid of, although it is something you should certainly be prepared for. Although who am I to know? I missed that class. Can you give me a hand? No, I can give you a fist. A fist full of help. I'm kind of like Gordon Ramsay. You never know which way I'm going to swing. Like a willow in the breeze, I'll slap food out of your hand because it's too raw. The only raw I accept is WWE raw. Pig farmer's a noble profession. What are you talking about? It takes a lot of work teaching a pig how to farm. Oh no, it's the twins. No, not Fred and George. You can tell he's, he's seen the show. He knows what's about to happen. He's read the books. He's read all the fan theories. He's read the theory that says crossbow plus sword equals we're all going to die. It's got 3,000 upvotes on Reddit. No, I think I'll do nothing. Is there a lie down option? Telltale games are very encouraging of nihilism. Nothing wrong with that. The Nile provides life to many people in Egypt. But double meanings aside, it is a concept with some merit. It just is to be applied sparingly. Thinking nothing matters, shrugging and accepting all futility, would do nothing to change the position of yourself or your peers or anything at all for that matter. But of course the nihilist would then agree, why does any of that matter? Why does happiness matter? Why does anything matter at all? And to them I would say, touche, Walder Frey. Keeping it topical, you see. Gotta insert a, a Song of Ice and Fire character to keep George R.R. R. Martin from cursing me with his vibrant and verbose passages. Something's wrong with our guns, boys. Check out this hashtag gameplay, www.playingthegame.com. Here we are, QQQQQQ. Oh man, I feel so accomplished. It really triggers the dopamine right in my brain there. It really keeps me off the gambling addiction. It's Q for quick time event, you see. They think they're clever. And they are clever. I never thought of that. I realise that this whole channel of mine is becoming very cynical. Crash Bandicoot, I think, was the highlight of my career. Had plenty of storytelling. It had plenty of my my flair that I like to put in. Bit of a bit of pizzazz, bit of sparks. But I want you to understand that this cynicism of mine, this growing seed of cynicism, blossoming into a tree of hate. It has basis. You may have noticed the majority of this video has just been low frame rate footage, right? Check this out. So I want to go to the settings. I want to turn down the, the graphics. Check out that lighting there. I don't want any of that. That's slowing down my bamboo Westeros computer far too much. You know where I bought this computer from? Let me tell you. I bought it from Dawn, all right? The only computers they have there are made of sand. You get a stick, you draw pictures in the sand and pretend you're playing Etch-a-Sketch. It's awful, but at the same time it's all they have. Save a hell of a lot on power bills though. The point is, what do you expect from video settings? Audio video settings, you expect some volume controls, you expect ambient volume controls, you expect the ability to turn off shadows, turn on shadows, variations of shadows. Check out what you get. Look at that. Master volume, music volume, display subtitles and brightness. These four things. What am I supposed to do? It's almost a false choice, you know? Okay, for you you fans of Zimbabwe politics out there, this is like the, the race between Robert Mugabe and Morgan Changarai a few years ago. So, you know, it looked like a democratic election. It looked like a bipartisan election. But then you have 125% of the voting population voting for Robert Mugabe. You know something's going wrong there. It's a false choice, right? This crap here, these four options, this is like, that's Robert Mugabe, that's Robert Mugabe, that's Robert Mugabe, that's Robert Mugabe. That's Morgan Changara. Guess what happens when you try to vote for him? You're out. You're dead. Texture, let's crank that all the way down. Anti-aliasing, no thanks. Don't have any room for that in this toaster. Crank that resolution up to something above a postage stamp. Christ. 
All right, let's try to be a bit more friendly, yeah? King's Road. I didn't even clean the sword. Did I learn nothing from the from the tent party with the boys? I, I don't mind the aesthetic of this game. It's sure it's a bit cartoony, but it's always the way of it. That's the telltale art style. I'm fine with that. I wonder what happens when I just do nothing. Let's just accept fate. We're a nihilist, remember? Valar Morghulis is actually Spanish for I need a cup of coffee. I think if you want to ask me a question, I'm going to ask one back. Garrod, I spilled tomato soup down my front. Please help me clean it up, my boy. It's strange juxtaposition this game has. You've got this cartoon atmosphere, but they're also trying to evoke the spirit of thrones the gruesome gritty spirit which admittedly in the show is more kill people for shock value rather than end their arc by killing them and by arc i mean story arc i should probably clarify some of these things more but I'm, i refuse to we're trying to keep it succinct you see you have things to do in your day and i don't that doesn't mean i have no respect for your time and by time i mean the herb goes great in omelets <laughs> the art of warcraft that's a difficult one, you got to know how to customise your hotbars just right. Would you like to play a game on the throne? And I'm not talking about playing Clash of Clans on the toilet. Oh, check it out everyone, we're doing exposition. Asher, age 23, exiled to Essos, has a dark secret. Find out more on chapter 3 for 9.99. Mirror, mirror on the wall, why the heck are you so tall? In times like this, medieval people were short because they cared less about nutrition and more about battles fought. What is with this obsession with swords among little boys and highest lords? Ryan, Ryan on the wall. If there's a crime, I know who to call. Lady Forrester, even taller. At the NBA, she's baller. Here we are, it's Big Lord Man. Driving round his Big Lord van. It's Catelyn Stark equivalent. My family are having a nap in the woods. They ate too much sauce and got sleepy. Look, we need a viewpoint character on the wall. Think of what the viewers want. They want to see the chiseled jaw of Jon Snow. I'm like a young Nietzsche. In my head right now, I'm just thinking God is dead and not quite paying attention to anything that's going on. <laughs> I've been waiting to tell you something. Nothing at all. I imagine I sort of just go, whoosh, 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 sort of pretend to whisper to him. All you're doing is making noises. What does that mean? You can't tell anyone. The only truth I know is that nothing matters. Thus spoke Zarathustra. Winter's coming. What do you th You want me to take that? I'm not going to. I'm just going to stare you down, you know. Nope, not going to take it. Nope. Run along, little girl. Not